when I started with Adam, I observed him at home and in the special needs preschool. And he was in his own world. The kids around him were were just uh, running around, negotiating play. Um, he was in his own world. And at one point, he even, he didn't have a one-to-one when I was there. And even at one point, he started licking the wall. And I had to, of course, get up and stop that. But little Adam didn't make any progress for a whole year. And so one of the very common mistakes I see both parents and professionals making is, is they think that just exposing kids to other typically developing kids is going to make social and play skills come naturally. And it involves a lot of work. And it usually involves a lot of work with teaching language. 